Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day. From the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for January the 10th of 2020, well, it is titled Nacreous Clouds Over Sweden. So what do we see here? Well, this is a type of cloud that occurs in the upper atmosphere and can give some very beautiful sights as you can see the glowing and shimmering of different colors. They're very thin clouds and they actually form up in the stratosphere, which rarely forms clouds and that's because it is relatively dry. So clouds form from, in the lower atmosphere, water vapor or up higher generally ice crystals that form and form into cloud-like structures. And those are what we usually see. And again, we're used to seeing water vapor clouds. Well, these are icy clouds that can occur from time to time up in the lower part of the stratosphere. So they're not near as common, but they're also very high in the atmosphere. And that means they can see around the curved limb of the Earth. So while the sun may be below the horizon for somebody on the ground, these clouds up much higher in the sky can still see over that curvature and therefore can see the sunlight. So they still are receiving sunlight, even though the sun may be well below the horizon at this point for somebody standing on the ground. And the thin clouds will actually diffract sunlight. So shortly before sunrise and shortly after sunset, they can diffract sunlight and give the various scattering of colors that we see here. And these are also sometimes called mother of pearl clouds because of the iridescence that we see, those shimmering colors that we can associate with mother of pearl as well. Now the iridescence or shimmering of colors that we see is often seen in other cases as well. Sometimes you'll see this on the soap bubbles or in an oil slick, something where you're getting uh, that layer that is causing that diffraction that, that gives us these various different colors uh, kind of split up and can make a very beautiful sight if you get a chance to see this. Again, to be able to see these, you really need to be at pretty high latitudes. So this was taken in Sweden, uh, but you see them at very high latitudes or uh, very far north or very far south. You don't normally see them at uh, tropical latitudes or even temperate latitudes. Got to be much higher further north or south to really be able to get a chance to view this type of clouds that form again in the lower part of the stratosphere and give us this shimmering, iridescent kind of mother of pearl look. So that was our picture of the day for January the 10th of 2020. It was titled, Nacreous Clouds Over Sweden. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be and beyond. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.